Hi, I'm David Turok, and I'm here at the Maryland Clean Energy Center. I'm going to tell you some things about the Chevy Volt. Okay, so, what can I tell you about it? Well, first of all, I ordered my first Volt in August. I'd been of 2010, right? Of 2010. Okay. I've been anticipating it for probably two years, basically since Bob Lutz announced it. I'd wanted one. Bob Lutz is the chairman of GM. That's correct, at okay. the time anyway. Um, prior to that, I'd had three RAV4 EVs, the all-electric RAV4s that were in the movie Who Killed the Electric Car, and had absolutely fallen in love with those, having a wonderful time driving them. But the Volt concept is really what captured me. The issue with the Volt concept is most Americans, about 90%, drive 40 miles or less round trip every day. So 90% of the personal miles that are right now burned with or achieved through petroleum could be replaced with electricity, and that electricity can be domestically produced, so it reduces the funding of terrorism, it reduces pollution, right? and you can produce it through renewable sources, which is a lot of what this clean energy conference is about, through wind and solar. So Dave, you, not, you have not one, not two, but three Chevy Volts. I have Why? three Chevy Volts. Why? In electric vehicles, if you're not familiar, there's the energy there's a lot of torque and everything at the bottom end, so it's just a fabulous car to drive. Okay, so how do they drive? First of all, that's the thing that surprised me. I've had a Prius, I've had electric vehicles and things before. The Volt's really very solid. It's like a, it's, oh, like a very high-end, uh, like a Mercedes C almost. Really? Right? Yeah, I was very surprised. Absolutely solid on the road. You know, with the car, sometimes you like hit a bump and it starts moving across and everything. Not true at all. Absolutely rock solid. It has a sports mode, which is a real kick. You can change the profile where you hit it up into sports mode and it actually zips. It probably does zero to 60 in about six seconds, something like that. It really pushes you back in the seat. A right. um, lot of fun. All right, last question. What yep. kind of gas mileage do you get? Well, here's the best part of it. Here's the best part of it. The first volt, I sort of used it in a mode where I said, let's see how this thing works as a gas car mostly. And I plugged it in when it was convenient, but not so much. The latest volt, I said, well, okay, I'll plug it in sort of whenever I stop it if there's power available. The first volt, and the volt has in its meter, a thing that says lifetime average. It's not something the user can tweak or reset. Oh. It's actually with the car, right? Oh, really? The first volt, which I just plugged in when it was vaguely convenient, is well over 100 miles a gallon, about 105. The third volt, 250 plus. Seriously? I've burned 0 0.2 gallons of gasoline in the last 1,300 miles. Goodness. All right, David, thank you very much. You're very welcome. Appreciate it.